hello everyone welcome to rc codex and in this video we're gonna create this scenery this beautiful scenery having sun boats and shining stars this river a beautiful scenery and uh, this project will be only created with html and css i hope every one of you know or familiar with these languages and today you're gonna create with html and css this scenery this beautiful project that will surely enhance your create website creating skills or like coding skills you will get to know uh, unique properties keyframes in this project so okay let's start uh, from html okay yeah so you can see first we have created a div having class top and another div having class stars this stars is stars div is under top class div okay and we will create uh, star divs there are so many star divs like from 3 to 59 uh, sorry sorry 3 to 32 so almost 29 stars are there we will create shooting star div we will give it a class shooting star like uh, and uh, some we will add it some clouds by giving uh, a class cloud there are three clouds div as you can see and uh, there is a sun that uh, i can see you in see and you also there yeah this this ring this circular is sun and uh, the effect uh, the three effects around the sun you can see first second and third so we will create a class glow one glow two and glow three of sun okay we will create pyramids like there are four pyramids class we have chosen so you can see this one this two this three this four we have created these four pyramids and uh, we have created another class bottom another class boat and uh, there are four squares uh, as we will see in designing that uh, how we have uh, created this okay like we have created board behind board top left board top right uh, this will be used for keyframes or animation in our scenery so we have created these div and giving the properties like then we have created port bottom we again have discovered four squares we another have created a div board behind board left it will help in moving the boat uh, you can see i it i see you this boat like it's moving right sometime left it's shadow you know so it will help in that case and then we will create a div having class oh sorry having class main sun reflection that uh, you can see on the water and uh, these small small lines are creating reflection so we will create from uh, div 80 to uh, similar class to div 99 then we will close this and create another div giving it a class small sun reflection small reflections of sun okay and that's all we have completed our html code and if you move to our scss code you can just go through it before that if you haven't buy our ebook and you want such projects like there are hundreds of projects in that ebook i have included a uh, mern ebook it's complete from scratch like from html css and tailwind javascript react node each and every part with revision notes with projects with placement question so the link will be you will be find in description so just check out this also and uh, let's move to our scss again like uh, now we will design this <clears throat> so when we design this first uh, we have some variable declarations uh, that uh, defines different colors that are used in the code that uh, you can see orange light orange yellow purple pink then we have body giving it a margin zero height 100 vh and overflow hidden giving it a position before and after and some these properties 
then we will style body with uh, these properties and uh, now we are having some background elements also like dot top dot bottom these two variables uh, these two elements help uh, uh, classes create gradient backgrounds for top and bottom halves okay like dot stars this class creates twinking stars in css animation this class like shooting star helps in shooting star across the sky dot sun and dot sun glow these classes creates sun glowing effect you can just see the uh, properties i have used in these classes and you can go through the code and this pyramid and pyramids this will style the pyramids and clouds dot cloud class creates moving cloud shape with animation now if we move to our keyframes right so if we move to our keyframes uh, you can see that uh, there is a twinkle that uh, animates the opacity of stars to create a twinkling effect uh, as you are uh, seeing in the project also and this uh, shooting star this property animates the movement and opacity of the shooting star and uh, i am just explaining the what this property helps in this case i am not explaining like uh, you have to set margin zero you can just do it yourself also so i am just explaining the properties the elements i have used in this project so another element is like boat and dot boat class creates a styles boat you know it creates a stylish boat uh, with various elements like a body top bottom behind some squares also and uh, if we move to the animations like uh, this wave property animates the boat to create a movement and this boat animates the boat to create the motion you know like moving the boat is moving now. for that animation it is used and for placement and animations like dot boat and it's type one and and it's type two this sets the positioning and animation of boat that uh, one on the left side and other on the right side of view so this is the project that uh, i have created and uh, i know you loved it that's why you uh, just going through it uh, till now and uh, if you are seeing till this so please just do subscribe our channel for these projects and like the video share it with your friends and thank you so much for watching thank you